morning you guys and welcome back to my channel so i am making some pancakes over here for ray i need to hop on a call here in a minute it is friday so the work week is not done yet um so ray's gonna eat her breakfast while i hop on my hi. call yeah you want to say hi say hi yeah so hopefully she'll just chill and eat her breakfast hi. and be calm sometimes while well, I'm on my call. calls that early but it just so happened that today we had one anyway that was a little bit stressful because Ray was trying to eat breakfast slash throw everything on the floor and she's just so busy these days that I was like ah, trying to be present on the phone call but also make sure she doesn't destroy things around the house so today we're actually cutting her morning nap I'm just gonna do it and see how it works out so so instead of having a morning nap at nine, she's just gonna stay up until after lunch. And so we'll put her down around 12.30 and she'll hopefully sleep till about 3.30 or four, we'll see. Okay you guys, if you watched my What I Eat in a Day, you saw me make these little egg muffins. They are so good. And I've been having these with two strips of bacon the past few mornings and it is delicious. And I decided to add this on top today because this stuff is bomb and I forgot I had it. This is from Trader Joe's. It's just their chili onion crunch. It's just red pepper chili flakes, I guess, and has some onion, like crispy onion stuff in there as well. But it is definitely spicy, so just fair warning. So for those of you who've been following me along on this 90 day fitness journey, I fill out this little Book, this little journal every day and every week I go through and just sort of review how the week went and so for this past week I didn't really set any goals because last week I was just so busy and I didn't really have time to sit down and review the week and set goals for the next week oh no Ray's crying can you hear that she's probably getting in trouble she's been getting in trouble so much even though she's 15 months old she doesn't really get in trouble she just gets into things and we're like, oh no, you can't touch that. You're gonna get hurt. We're just trying to help you. But anyway, so sorry if you can hear her crying. She's with Eric right now. Um, anyway, so I did go through and kind of look at the week and how it went. And I think the things that are really helping me out is prepping food. So I made egg bites this week. I had veggies on hand. I had not necessarily planned out meals but I, I had a lot of ideas and things on hand f to make those meal ideas I guess because sometimes I hate being restricted to a menu if that makes sense but one thing that hurt my progress this week I think is going to bed late which continues to happen 
Last week I was pretty good about my bedtime, but this week I think I need at least seven hours. It seems like seven to eight hours seems to be the perfect amount of sleep for me. I can get, I can get on with six hours of sleep. I can, but I function best at just over seven hours of sleep, I think. And that's each night. So I really need to make that a priority this week. But my main goal for this week is to do two strength training days. I've kind of been slacking on my strength training, like my weightlifting, all that stuff, because I've just been so focused on my running. And I don't want to be just focused on cardio because that's when you plateau. And I really want to push myself to get stronger. And that's where weightlifting comes in. So tomorrow I will be running 12 miles with my sister. We might do 14. I think we're going to do 12. But anyway, so I'll be running 12 miles with my sister tomorrow morning, which would be great. But... I need to definitely plan out some strength training days for next week, so I'm kind of setting my schedule out, seeing what I'll be doing. I think Mondays and Wednesdays or Mondays and Fridays I'll be doing strength training. And as far as my progress goes for this week, I haven't lost any weight. Um, I have lost weight since I started three weeks ago, but the first two weeks I lost about a pound, a little over a pound a week, and this week I didn't seem to lose anything, not an ounce according to my weight this morning but I weigh myself the same time every week and you know after having the same amount of food or whatever which is usually nothing because I weigh myself in the morning but anyway so I'm at 125.8 and I started out at 128.2 I believe I have a, a 128.4 so I've lost 2.6 pounds and when I go to the gym on Monday morning to do my strength training day, I'm going to measure my body fat and just see where I'm at there. I love turning the page over for week four because look how cute this is. You've got this. I don't know, just little details like that I really enjoy. And yeah, so I'm motivated and ready to take on the week. I really like that my weeks start on Friday because otherwise I feel like if I were to end, like have my week start on Monday, I'd already be motivated because like Mondays I'm always motivated. Now this makes it so I'm like motivated going into the weekend to stay focused on my goals and the progress I want to hit. So glad it starts on a Friday. That's a tip I'll give you guys. One thing is a lot of people are like, oh, I'll start my, you know, my new workout tomorrow or on Monday or whatever, but just start today. Start whatever day it is, just start because that's when you know you're really gonna do it is if you can make yourself start on a day that you wouldn't already be motivated to start like the first of a month or a Monday. All right, I've got a lot more work to do. Not a lot, but I've got about 20 minutes more work to do before I take Ray to her 15 month appointment. I can't believe we're going to her 15 month appointment today, it's crazy. Um, but yeah, it's her 15 month appointment with her pediatrician, so we'll see how that goes and hopefully I can film an update on Ray this weekend for you guys. All right, if you guys follow me on Instagram, you've seen this, but here's the wallpaper I'm putting up on my wall tonight. I think me and my sister are gonna do this tonight. She's sleeping over because we're gonna go on another run tomorrow morning, so anywho, there's that. So excited. Thank you. 